Manapad is a picturesque fishing village which provides widely different beauty of beaches than that we experience in Kerala and Tamil Nadu. When we land here, we feel the aesthetic serenity of the blue seas, shallow lagoons, tiny islets where the fishing boats docked in rows and the calmness of the place once used by a saint to meditate. The view of sands and waves from the sea cliff is breathtaking. Just like the Fort Kochi at Kerala, Manapad gives us a feel of another country that we are closely knitted with. Manapad is called Chinna Jerusalem as Christians believe a relic fragment of true cross is kept inside the St. Francis Xavier Church, which is situated at the cliff. It is believed that St. Francis came to Manapad in 1542 stayed in a sandstone cavern and converted many people to Christianity. A big grand old uh, cross is also placed in open. Folklore says that in 1540 a Portuguese trading vessel while sailing around the Cape of Good Hope was destroyed by a violent storm. The captain made a vow that he would construct a cross from a portion of the splintered mast and have it planted on the shore where they erected in safety. The vessel, after having drifted for several days, reached Manapad. Then they built the cross there. The church festival will be conducted every year from September 1 to 14. Many films were shot at Manapad. This include Maniratnam's Kadal, Tamil blockbuster Singam 2, Shujit Sangesh, Madras Cafe, Gaudam Banu's Neetane N. Punbasandam, Sinu Ramaswamy's Nir Paravai, and S.P. Jagannathan's Yakkare. Two more beautiful churches are also there. It is inside the hamlet. We reached there in the evening. Periyagol, which is called the St. James Church, has a mighty look. Chinnakovil, also known as Holy Ghost Church, and the people living around give the feel of a different culture. Many buildings around the church are old and are dilapidated stage. Manapad is 60 km from Tutukudi, 18 km from Tirichandur and 70 km from Kanyagumari. It is a place worth visit. Don't forget to have food from Vali restaurant, especially the, the, the spicy Natu Kodi meals.